Hey, what's up? It's Sergeant Dr. Funger. We're back with more Fire Emblem, and this is where we get to put our troll face on. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Here we go. It's gonna work this turn, because I have him very, very well surrounded, so... This is totally... This is totally happening. <laughs> and now he can't do shit. <laughs> Unless I put someone in his range, which I'm moving everyone out of at the moment. He can't do jack shit. <laughs> ah, troll face. This is why snipers are not bosses. This is totally why. <laughs> uh, speaking of which... Mate, damn it! Uh, I want them to. I want my... Yeah, I forgot, to t I forgot to talk about that, too. Both... Last video and, like, four videos ago. That, uh, Oh. Oops, I left Dorcas in his range, but... <laughs> he does have a long range, so you do have to be a little bit careful. Oh, see, dick! Hawkeye does not need your blood. Wait. Never mind. <laughs> um, but yeah, I didn't talk about this, but... With chapter 28... That scene that I got where El with Ella Wood and Ninian was actually um, kind of special. You can only get that if you have the A support, and I didn't, and I haven't explained that, and I don't know why. If you have Ella Wood and Ninian at the A support, you get the um, you get uh, that special scene between those two when she dies. Um, I mean, she still dies without it, but um, you don't, you don't like. There's not a conversation between them. I actually had a really hard time, um, like, acting that out anyway, because I read somewhere, like, I think it was on TV Tropes, that <laughs> half of Ellawood and Ninian's dialogue was just them saying each other's names, and it's so true. It is so true. It's just like, oh my god. It's friggin' hilarious. I never noticed that before until right then. And I that was the first time I'd seen that cutscene after I after I heard that and it was just it was the funniest thing ever. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. See things are relatively quiet now. Like there's a lot going on. There's like a shit ton of enemies in the in the beginning. But now it's now it's kind of quieted down, so and we're just going to let Ellawood get some experience cuz you know he's our main lord. You know, he's the main character. He should be he should be pretty good. What are you doing? Besides throwing up from your poison. Oh. No, he's still doing pretty well actually. <laughs> he's hanging in there. You got to give it to him. He's hanging in there. Okay. Uh Dorcas, help him out. Give him a, give him a help out there. Excellent. I think this guy's all out of eclipses. No. Damn it. <laughs> Wishful thinking on my part. Whatever. Oh, boy. What is this? What is this madness? Okay, so... Oh, you've got lances. Whatever. As if I care. Oh, shit. Well, he's poisoned now. <laughs> Doesn't matter. He's got plenty of HP. And he just leveled up again. Except in this game, you don't get... Oh, that's such a buzzkill. It's like, yay, level up. Level is he? 11. Dude, come down here, guy. We need you. You're not guy. Guy's not even in this game. Well, he's in this game, but he's not in this round of... Oh, damn! Reminds me of, of one time that I that I played this chapter, and it was actually the case where the green... Oh, Moment of silence for the for the last green guy in the game. Moment of silence over. Oh, it's the last turn already. Holy shit. What the hell are you people trying to do to me? Um So let's see. So on the last turn we like to take out uh Denning cuz that's just, you know, He's sitting there. He's a high-level archer. He's got... Does he have something for us? No, but, you know... Either way. Anyways, we, we do... We want to take him out. 
And I'm thinking I want to do it since Elwood, I just used him. That was kind of an accident. Kind of me not thinking, but hey. Um, let's do it with whatever she's best with. Okay, 15? Sure. Um, how about Louise attacking from here? Can he attack? He can attack back. Um, I'm try I don't know what I don't know what I'm gonna need from Canis to beat him. So let's let's check it. Let's check that out. Fourteen. He can do fourteen like that. Six like that, and twenty-one with Luna. So we'll yeah we'll we'll go with that. I think <laughs> seems like our best bet there. Damn you, Oswin! This is a message from Lord Nurga. Well then. Wait, does this chapter end when you kill Denny? No, it doesn't. Okay, well that's fine. <laughs> that's just a way to keep him in line while he is alive, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> keep him alive while, while you know... Why don't why didn't I just kill him earlier then? It's still a fun thing to do. I was just like that means I was seriously just trolling him. I was seriously just trolling Denning. <laughs> I was just trolling him. That's that's pretty funny. It's pretty good on me. I like that. Oh. Okay. Oh, there's just one guy left and it's him and he's going to he can't do shit. I don't have any long range magic so I can't Oh my god, mate. No, I didn't get it. Are you serious? Oh my god. Damn it. Well, this is legitimately disappointing now. Particularly since I didn't get either of them. She's only level two? Oh god, this run is doomed. Yeah, just whatever. You have to cut. Well, this is a bust. <laughs> I'm in the way of one of the Green Knights. Protect Lord Hector. There's only one guy left, and he could probably take all ten of those guys out. He just ran randomly. Good stuff. Hey, Greybeard, are these guys? Yes, I'm sure of it. They are his morphs. It's true. They're all eerily similar. That reminds me. That man on Valor, Ethidel. Black Fang Sonia, too. Are you saying that he made them all? It is an abomination, a crime against all that is natural. When Nurgle began using Morse to carry out his plans, his power had grown beyond our ability to contain him. After humans, his next target became the essence of dragons. His next target had to be Arcadia. I concealed our paradise behind a curtain of sandstorms, then I hid in the underground ruins and waited for him. I did not hope to defeat him, just to exchange blows, then draw him into the desert, which would be his end. Yeah, right. Because leaving a guy there would be... Yeah. No idea but how he managed it, but he called those siblings through the dragon's gate. Well, f f I don't know when we'll find out more about that, but we will. <laughs> At some point in the future. What do we have to do to stop him? Our last hope is the power of the legendary items. It would take too long for us to gather all of them. I will go to the Shrine of Seals and tell Bramamond everything. We must have his power, no matter the cost. Then we should go to the dragon's gate ahead of you. What? That's a good idea. Even though you cannot harm Nurgle himself, you can certainly do some damage to his troops. If we don't answer Nurgle's invitation soon, he'll continue to send troops after us. But if that's what's going to happen, we might as well take the fight to him. I won't have Lysia ravaged by any more of his acts. Acts. You truly are Roland's children. I am old. I did not expect anything to surprise me again, and yet... Lord Athos, it takes the strongest of bonds to alter the course of fate. Go, my youthful friends. Set your sights on the dragon's gate and keep moving. Ellawood, what happened to Durandal? It's right here, I'm sorry. I simply couldn't bring myself to wield it. Let me have it for a while, is that all right? Yes. Ellawood, I understand how you feel. But without this weapon, we won't be able to stop Nurgle. You know that, don't you? Yes. When next I wield it, I won't hesitate. I know. Side quest? We ain't got time for side quests. What is this shit? <sighs> God damn it. Well, I don't think I want to go ahead and uh, 
I could. Ah, let's introduce it. Battle preparations, what the hell? We've received word from Captain Fargus. If we come to Badan, he'll give us passage to the Dread Isle. Well then, let's get going. It would be best if we outfitted ourselves before setting out. We would need many supplies for a campaign on Valor. And the castle town here is better stocked than Badan, I'm sure. We can empty the coffers here and sell the treasures if need be. Uh, within limits, of course. Say 30,000 gold? That seems a reasonable amount. Come on, I'll lead the way. Ostia's castle town is as impressive as ever. This this cutscene doesn't make any sense. It talks about, like, the Ostian government, which is cool. I like that because, once again, it's, like, the most expansive world, like, ever. <laughs> which covers everything from, like, poor people to, you know, transgenderism, like, the peer system. Like, rich people and shit. So, hey. Um. So, yeah. <laughs> this is, but it's just random in the face of everything else. <sighs> Curious. What is it, Lindus? Hector. He acts like such a brute, but he takes his duty seriously. Hector has always been a man of firm character. I've always envied him for that. His ability to conceal any doubts he feels about himself or his... At what? Was that a sentence? I don't think that was a sentence. She wouldn't hesitate about anything. Grandfather's health. Uh, this chapter's gonna depress me because I didn't get Hector and Lynn to A support by now. And, um, I don't know. Maybe I can still... I don't know if I can still get it in this chapter, but we'll see. I'll try it. I don't, I don't know if it'll work. I don't think it will, but... You get a special scene for doing that, too, so... Um... Yeah. Everything dear to us. Thanks, I already lost Ninian. Okay, well, this is actually a good place to stop, because I have a lot of preparation to do for this chapter, because you need to... You know, pull out all the stops and get ready, and I'm understocked as it is, so... Um... Next time on Fire Emblem, we get to go shopping! That sounds so exciting, but... Yeah, we'll see what all we get to do. I mean, I could really skip this chapter, but I'm not gonna because it's fun. Anyways, I'll see you next time. Thanks for tuning in.